Got something to snack on, too. Hello, sir. Vimy. Well, well. Look who's here. The White Wolf himself in my humble establishment. How can I be of service? How's business going, Vimy? How's business? Really? That's the best you've got. That's like asking a fisherman if they're biting, or an old gran about her health. Business is booming. There's profit to be made from war, provided you've the know-how. Before Nilfgaard had even crossed the Pontar, I'd contracted for insured deliveries of wood and iron from Kovir. Reaped a sevenfold return on my investment. Hey. Nice. So you might think, but then there's the non-human poll tax, the church's tithe, war taxes, and my overhead. Subtract all that and you're left with a pittance. A dozen or so chests and no more. A dozen chests of coal, though. But, yeah, I get it. <coughs> <coughs> Fucks over any normal trader. Got some coin I'd like to convert into crowns. You've come to the right place. A better rate you'll not find anywhere in the city. Truth is, we're all ready to... 636. How can I be of service? Give me that loan, buddy. I need coin. Guess I have to take out a loan? Of course. I'll arrange it right away. Just like that? Lady Yennefer of Vengerberg long ago declared herself your guarantor. Were these circumstances ever to arise? Besides, we tried and true methods for collecting debts. <laughs> All right. Oh, hello. Oh, Arms for the poor. You lame? No, Charles. Both legs in perfect order. And me arms look like a windmill's wings. There. See me waving them? Looky here. Just look. In my mind, thorough addled. How long your mind been addled? Been like this long. Addled. Since me mother birthed me. Here's where it's adult. There. Showing you with me finger. See that? Me indicating. Hmm. Get a picture of health. Healthy as a horse, as far as I can tell. Priests have looked, medics, herbalists. All claimed I'm bewildered. Well, they're wrong. That's little either way. Folk are generous to me. They enjoy watching me point. Like this. There. There. <laughs> You're happy. That's what counts. I am. When folk ask me the way, I like that most, because I can point. Like this. There. Ah. Because I know my way around the city. Oh, do I ever. So you gotta know where the Putrid Grove is, right? Most certainly do. It's where I live. Over the, uh, there. There. That way. That away. Meaning where? In Lace Halls. There's this alley, past the gate. Not at all putrid and not a grove. Fools call it that, but I know better. And anyone can go there? Of course. Unless he forgets to say, the old sow's farrow piglets might not let you in then. But that's easy enough to say. Listen, the old sow's farrow piglets. See? Thanks for your help. Okay. All right. Old sow's farrow piglets. <laughs> Let's go see what we can find, oh. shall we? Ah! Oh, bitch. Sick. Sick. Ah! Excuse me, sir. Knock, knock. Open up. What have you got back there? Nah. Take a look. What do you see? Yellow eyes. Pair of swords. Mutated kill at me. Heard this place was a meeting spot for oddities. Heard right. 
Know the password, get him free. Don't know him. Gotta to contribute to the Graves upkeep. Old Sal's furrowed piglets. Old Sal's furrowed piglets. Ah. Welcome to the Grove, brother. made something clear, sorceress. Yes, high time. Me and my men will manage just fine without the help of you or any other mages. But you, well, without our help, you're sitting ducks for the temple guard. Who do I spy? Geralt? Mm-hmm. Hey, Triss. See you two know each other. See you two know each other well. I was curious whether you'd managed to find me, Witcher. You knew, huh? Your spies tell you I was looking for the Putrid Grove? My skull would be a home for bottom-feeding river fish if I didn't keep an ear to the ground. And please, Putrid Grove? Ugly name for our cosy little hideout, wouldn't you say? Yeah, but no other name for it. Temple Guard even bother you, so what do you call this place? Temple Guard tolerate your little operation. Let's say they appreciate the value of a Novigrad crown. Hmm. Manga doesn't seem like the type that can be bought. Anyone can be bought. But like is true, Manga had cost me a fortune. Luckily, he's got officers, and they're mere mortals. Illnesses catch him at times. Other times, they want to catch a bit of diversion. See, Witcher? I've got plans. Big plans. Far-reaching plans to reshape this city head to toe. Ever thought of seeking a seat on the City Council? City Council is a puppet troop with a hierarchy of the Church of the Eternal Fire as its puppeteer. Until recently, that is, when Radovid and his witch hunters took the reins. The semblance of power don't interest me. What do you want? You don't stand a chance now. What do you want? A man with a vision. <clears throat> One day, the so-called free city of Novigrad will be truly free. But before that can happen, we got a riddit of superstition, farting around about the hallowed essence of the eternal fire. Nonsense for kiddies. Apparently not. Cheering crowd at the execution. Mostly adults. Any crowd of rabble will cheer to the stench of burning flesh. But one day, folk will understand the eternal fire's naught but a leash around their necks. They call this place the Putrid Grove. But it's the rest of Novigrad that's putrefied. This year's the last bastion of normality, sanity, reason. I'm actually glad someone like you's found his way to our city. Because it will be our city one day, Geralt. Mark my words. Yours, plural. Yeah, mine. And me friends. But that's a tale for another time. For now, I'll leave you two alone. Because I can see, well, you clearly need it. Geralt, I have a lot of things to take care of in town. I'll be glad to tag along. I'll come with. What's your arrangement? He using you? Helping me to survive, actually. Six months ago, if somebody said Triss Marigold would be working for a Novigrad criminal, I'd never have believed it. Six months ago, Triss... 
Madam Sorceress. Beautiful, is it? Damn shame to part. Don't fret. Bound to be back soon. I take it you're a Novigrad on important business. Mm -hmm. Important doesn't do it justice. I'm looking for someone. More precisely? Young woman who's like a daughter to me. Her? Here? No, impossible. She was here. There are witnesses, evidence. Was hoping you'd heard something. You've been here a while. I need you to help me find something, anything, a trace. I'll do everything I can, of course. Who might know more? Uh, thanks. Thanks, Trace. I appreciate it. Now let's go help you. Hello, Klug. Managed to get those magic incense ingredients? Yes, somewhat with uh, difficulties, you might say. I was walking along the canal with a sack full of goodies for you. Looked up and spied a trio of temple guards coming the other way. Get to the point, Klug. No time today for one of your long stories. Wait! Huh. A sack full of magicalities and they were coming straight towards me. I don't easily frighten, but uh, I felt a cold sweat on my arms, I did. I'm afraid I had no choice. I dropped the sack in the water. I had to. When asked why, I claimed it contained a dead cat. They shan't believe this. But they believe me. I need that package, Klug. I've got a contract. It must be on the canal bed. Luckily, it was heavy enough to sink. I'm sure it'll turn up if you search. You expect me to pay you, then dive for my goods into that ice-cold filth? Hmm. I'll get it. I can do that. Where'd you toss the package? Near the crane. Second bridge in from the harbor. I didn't expect such devotion. Wanted to freshen up anyway. Let's go. Stop. Hear that? They've come for us. The fool didn't break until I began to prick his heels. Every man's got his sensitive spots. Interrogated a mage once. Pain couldn't touch him. Tore off his fingernails, crushed his bollocks. Nothing. Turned out. I placed a beetle on his belly and set a mug atop it. Damn, you went mad. We were lucky this time, but you'd best leave via the sewers. The trapdoor's in the floor. Take care of yourself, Clue. All right, let's move. But first, I'm gonna take everything you own, Clue. Because there's always time to lose. Sorry, Tris. But you've known me long enough. I have to do this. And there's no guarantee I will be able to remember where this place is afterwards. But we're almost done. Let's move. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go. What the hell am I standing on? Oh, that little ledge? Really? Alright, let's go. Open. And... Alright, 
Well, there's a draft. She can exit here. Klug wouldn't have sent us here if there wasn't. The lever on this wall would open a secret passage. Free city of Novograd. The name actually used to mean something. The very reason so many mages came here after the massacre at Loch Mui. Thought they'd be safe from Rad of its Reapers. Instead, they jumped out of the frying pan with a fire. But Novigrad stands on top of a mountain of coin. And winning a war takes three things. Coin, coin, and even more coin. That's why they're exterminated. Judging by what Klug said, the parcel should be around here on the bottom. Unless the poor man was mistaken. He's been forgetful ever since Manga interrogated him. He seems to be suffering from a persecution complex, too. Current must have carried the sack seaward. I'll swim towards the port. Coming with? Uh, maybe some other time. Don't know what you're missing. Water's thick with pungent oils. Guessing it'll do wonders for my complexion. <laughs> Find the parcel? Yes, or did, did you get wet for no reason? Nothing like a refreshing swim in a filthy canal. Found a few fish, a rusty anchor, the carcass of a boat. Oh, and this. Oh, my package. Hope the contents aren't soaked through. Oh, you're a doll. That norm smile. Seem to be in your element. Still remember my elements? How I use them? Mm -hmm. Come on. Six months isn't that long. It's not like I'm senile. But you do have a history of amnesia. I've recovered my memory completely. Good. That should stop people from taking advantage of you. Someone's been taking advantage of me. I have, for one. I've never even intimated. We need to hurry. Greetings, sorceress. Greetings, Brandon. I didn't expect you to bring company. Is that a You told him you're a sorceress? Triss, you told this man you're a sorceress? Of course. She was looking for work. That's her chief asset. Are you, Triss? I know <laughs> it was reckless, but competition's stiff here. No one would hire me if I claimed to be a common rat catcher. More importantly, no one would believe such a beauty could be an exterminator of rodents. But I'd prefer you not to tarry and begin. Tris, you and Brandon here. You've agreed a price. We settled on a full coin purse. Brandon and Co. is a serious outfit. We've the largest granary in all Novigrad. In advance. Don't much like merchants who flatter with cheap praise before the job's done. That was not cheap praise. I was merely stating a fact. So am I. I want you to pay in full in advance. I'm afraid that's impossible. Then trap your own rats. Well, now I know why she brought you along. A fine, full purse of Novigrad crowns as proof of my goodwill. Thank you. We need to place these crystals around the greenery, near anything that looks rat-related. All right, that can be done. Where do you think you're going? I won't wait, you know. I was just going inside. Come on. Looks, Looks like a shit. good spot. I don't like that guy. Brandon? I don't either. He's much too fat. <laughs> Can't help but agree. But no. Notice how he didn't try to haggle? Must really want the rats out. Triss. He's a merchant. He makes his living by haggling. If I worried about that sort of thing, I'd starve to death in this city. I mean, 
yes, but <laughs> he's a merchant. I think I plugged every hole in there. All right. Get ready for some magic fireworks. Then again, also Once every, every rat problem in a warehouse like this would desperately make you lose business. Well? 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 You good? Tris? Well, there we go. Now we wait for them to scurry away. Interesting method. Never had much luck with rats. Once I hit one with a fork in complete darkness, trying to show off my witcher's senses. Masterful throw, really. Problem was, no one else saw it. How could they in the dark? <laughs> so, what do you think, rat catcher? It's a long way to fall from being advisor to Temeria's king. I'm just glad to see you safe and sound, and... Reconciled? Uh, are you truly or just pretending? It's good there isn't any bad feelings between us. Knew a man once who reacted to everything, especially adversity, by mocking it. Healthy attitude. Must have lived long. Came a day he lost both his legs in battle. He shrugged. Said it was better that way. He'd never feel pain in them again. I understand him perfectly. I know. Thing is, he was lying to himself. I think he just didn't have much of a choice. Uh, he could have faced the truth. Maybe you're right. We all lie sometimes. But lying to yourself is running away. Whereas there's really nowhere to run. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you have to escape just to forget. Your friend might have dwelled on his lost legs, but it's not like by grieving he could have grown another pair. So, tell me how Yen's doing? How do you know I found her? You didn't answer my question. How's Yen? Seems alright, but I don't really know. Don't know yet. Asking about anything specific? Never mind. I got my answer. Well, well. Are lovebirds having themselves a little chat instead of working? The job's done. Geralt, those are... I know who they are, Triss. My friends begged me to notify them if I encountered a mage, sorceress, what have you. Didn't have the heart to refuse. It's a trap, Geralt. This stank from the start. If these boys are here to help us kill rats, they're late. You paid up front and got what you paid for. Not half a rodent left in the granary. I paid in advance because I knew I'd recover my coin. Such is life for sorceresses in Novigrad these days. I can see that and I don't like it. So here's what I think. The hunters have come, and now they can go. They'll do no such thing. Then they'll All right, die. we've talked. Do what you gotta. Just remember, I can't help but get in your way. Heard enough from this poor son. As have I. Neither is to leave here alive. Looking for a proof. Get him from both sides! There we go. Help. Not for you. We need to find Brandon. Oh, we will. And he's right here. Don't kill me. Good sir, no. They forced me. Had I not told them, they'd have set fire to my home, my warehouse. The mage hunters know no mercy. Spare me, good man. Be not like those murderers. Shut up. I should kill you. Thing is, you'd be no good to anyone but the gulls as a corpse. So you'll live and pay us double. Now. 
Fine. Your coin. Now, get. Thanks, Geralt. Mm-hmm. No problem. He's lucky to be left alive. No need. Glad I could help. You know, I've been thinking who might know something about Siri, And I just got an idea. There's an Oniromancer in town, Kareem Tilly. Very capable, supposedly. Never trusted in Dreamer's abilities myself. Kareem's been very effective. You should at least try. She's taken a job close by. Follow the canal away from the fish market. The house is near the first bridge. Its owner, Dijon Kier, is a rich banker. Not coming with me? I've got some things to take care of. Another rat infested warehouse? <laughs> Not exactly. Nothing even remotely satisfying. Such are the times. All right, nice seeing you again. It was nice to see you again. You too, Geralt. You should go now, before Kareen goes back into hiding somewhere. What if I want to find you? I live in the bits, near the fish market. Stop by. It'll be nice. All right. See you later. All right. Well, that was finding Triss. Okay. Well, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, thank you for stopping by. I think I'm going to stop now before I overheat myself. Uh, so thank you all for watching. I enjoyed having you. I know, hope to God you enjoyed having me. And I will see you all next time. Thank you.